Well, guys, do you, in your own personal opinions, do you think Hooters is offensive? Of course not. Mm -hmm. Yes. She's a beautiful woman. Really? Just to say yes. Oh. I mean, once I go to Hooters, uh, just You're not too many, anymore. too many chicken wings. You know, just <laughs> I don't think the wings are as good as everyone says they I'm are. Wrong. Then that's pretty offensive too. I don't think say. it's like everyone. Your opinion is offensive. So good. <laughs> I don't know. I, I've been there once, and uh, I I was not swayed with the wings. Did you get the buffalo wings? I don't remember. This was a long time ago. I've never been there once. Really? You'd be a fan if you went there. Not once have I ever stepped foot in a Hooters, mm -hmm. but just knowing about Hooters, knowing its reputation, whatever, in my own personal opinion, I would not label Hooters as offensive. Yeah, the staff is friendly. Do you? They're very, they they want to fuck you from the moment you walk in. And, and it's only if you're lucky, and I, I am very lucky to be blessed. Mm. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, and yeah, so they, they're really attracted to you, and uh, you know, if you're lucky, and uh, yeah, I had a great time. Yeah. <laughs> I had a great so time. who could give me a, a truthful depiction of... I've never been to Hooters. I You've never been, been to Hooters? Been, yeah. But I don't know where the nearest one is. <laughs> his, his, his mind is yeah. blown. He's like, I'm like, like, are you there every weekend? When How I'm dare not? you? Ryan's like, no, wait, look, when you're, when you're in your early 20s, and you're not... Uh, in a relationship, and you're looking for a good yeah, time. You want to watch some sports, and then I, just be I nurtured by one. someone, and then really, eat some chicken wings. They really do play up the. Like, they're, they're pretty attentive. Yeah, yeah, they're they, pretty attentive. Uh, are in love with you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> if you're lucky, if you're lucky like I was, um, Ryan, yeah. I feel like Ryan's like, listen, I've never been to Hooters, but I do uh, use prostitutes. <laughs> <laughs> You know, if it's anything like the service that I get from the ladies, then yes, I would. I, <laughs> offensive. <laughs> Why waste my time? <laughs> no, like seriously, where, where's the nearest Hooters? Like, I don't even know. There, are they in somewhere? They're all over. There's one in Burbank. That, that, they used to oh, have that's the one airline. I went to. They used to have an airline, by the There's one in Hooters Airline? That sounds cool as fuck. <laughs> that does. Yeah. Yeah. Because I know they have a casino, but I've never been there because it's not like fucking close well, to the street. It just got changed. I, I do agree with yeah. Nelson. The wings are, hmm. Oh, so what's your impression of Hooters? Like when you walk in, what do you like? What is your review? It just feels like a regular restaurant, but then like the waitresses just have big boobs. <laughs> so they all do. Can I just say, what did you expect? Because that's literally how I would review them. Well. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, like, I just want. I just knew like what the branding of it was, and like I just didn't really seem very phased by. It. I was like, okay, cool. This is just like the style of the restaurant. Neat. You know, Jess Caldwell worked at Hooters, right? Yeah. Mm. That's all I know about her. It's not just big tail. That's all you knew. About her. <laughs> Yeah. Well, yeah. that's that's the only thing on a resume. <laughs> <It's> stupid. <laughs> gonna watch this too. The biggest lie ever. But Jess watches every single drink. <laughs> Literally every no, single minute. I don't even know what you guys are talking about right now. <laughs> it's like you guys think I just personally roasted her because I knew she'd be watching. That's absurd. Oh, okay. Wait, she's watching this? Yeah, exactly. What? Shit. No, I'm just kidding. I love you, Jess. Anyway. So back to or so this story. Time to here. beef up your resume. Out there. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen <Yeah>. Green. <laughs> so this child here, he was, he was uh, wearing this Hooters mask to school since August, mm -hmm. and nice. most recently a teacher of his told him to take off the mask, and he was like, "But why?" It's a family restaurant. And then the teacher was like, "Oh, you want to know why? Then go ask the principal why." And so he goes to the principal's office. That's how the teacher responded? Yeah. <gasps> oh, fuck like, that teacher. Someone else can take care of this What an problem. immature way to fucking yeah. address a fucking problem. Like, go ask your dad. Yeah, I agree. The most yeah. embarrassing thing he's wearing, too, is Michigan football. <laughs> They didn't even address that by the like. Come on, dude. like that's so offensive. Like, take that off. How do you make that up so fast? Oh, man, I noticed that too. That, that's so I just thought Monsters dude. University. Jim Harbaugh hasn't done shit with your program, but <laughs> I guess that's not offensive. This is like the typical letter M, though. How do you like? No, that's the M. Yellow M, dude. This is the Monsters Inc. M. Isn't it? No, no, no. It's, it also says Monsters Michigan University. Right there. It's also the <laughs> shitty football M. <laughs> Anyway, so, uh, okay, so then the teacher says, oh, well, if you really want to know, go ask the principal. So then he goes and he asks the principal, and then he's saying that the principal told him to take it off three times, and he asked him why. And then He's like, that's what I would tell any Hooters waitress, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> and then so he, he said, just take it off. 
So then the kid took it off and he had to wear a different mask. Oh, he sneezed. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say. The kid's name is Ian, by the way. So then when Ian, when Ian's dad went to go ask him, like, what the fuck? Like, what's the problem? And then they were saying that it had been deemed offensive. This mask has been deemed offensive. And then the principal told Ian that it's inappropriate because it expresses a woman's body. What? what? If you choose to think that way yeah, about it, mm. could Who be an owl. Yeah. Who says they're, they're hooters anymore? Dude, yeah. I know. It's Boobs, tits. I mean, those yeah. are more the, the jargon. I was gonna say, like, there's worse ones. Like, remember in like middle school and high school when they had like, like save the boobies, fucking. Oh yeah. Since all the fucking time, like, I feel like that's even more offensive no than that. Honkers is worse. Than honkers. <laughs> like fucking, it is. Yeah, yeah. just a giant mass of honkers. <laughs> Yeah, like you think about it, it's like Hooters is a restaurant. Whether or not they're known for whatever the fuck, it's like it's a restaurant. It's a family restaurant. If that said titties that many yeah. times, I'd yeah. be like, yeah, yeah. take yeah. it down. Exactly. Dude. Take it down, bro. Or maybe yeah. even boobies in. I'll give yeah. you boobies. Yeah. But yeah. Hooters, come on. So it, that's why it made the news because it's just like. It's just a weird hill to die on. Like, it's just a weird yeah. thing to have a fucking problem with that badly. Where, especially the petty, like, oh, go ask the principal, and the principal's just like, well, you know, making a big stink about it. It's just like, dude, don't you have better things to do, man? Like, or at least, like, educate them. You know, like, yeah. you guys are educated. Show them a picture of Jess Caldwell and be like, listen, it's not always <laughs> like this. <laughs> I love you, Jess. Yeah, anyway. I love you, Jess. I'm just doubling down on it. Fuck it. <laughs> no, but you gotta see her booty, though. <laughs> so, what do you say? Do tell. Oh, yeah, you wanna. Uh, yeah, uh, expand on that? You wanna reverse the laptop <laughs> around for that? So. <laughs> yeah, there it is. <laughs> no, but anyway, so then the dad was saying, he's like, how is this inappropriate? He said, I've never viewed it as anything but a restaurant. Do we feel women's bodies are offensive? I don't know. I don't. The principal told me that it was inappropriate. I said, I don't understand why it's inappropriate. There's nothing wrong with that mask. So he's saying that he'll never stop taking his family to Hooters. And uh, he says, we do like the chicken wings. They have the best chicken. Wings. And the Caesar salad's not too damn bad either. <laughs> <laughs> I, will n uh, I just like how this changes into like a support Hooters. Like, it's and really it funny because Everyone's taking a hill to die on, including yeah. the dad. Yeah, yeah, everywhere. Yeah. everywhere. Yeah. everywhere. Oh, like, weird hills. Like. Yeah, they're like, none of these hills deserve dying yeah. on. <laughs> like, yeah. no matter what. He's like, Chili's to go? Yeah, I think we're still to going. Because <laughs> <laughs> he could have, I think he could have reinforced his idea without having to be like, this restaurant, we are going to this restaurant for the rest of our lives. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't like, need to be you, that extreme. Because he wasn't trying to get you to stop going to Hooters. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, yeah. now we're going. <laughs> He's like, now we're going for Thanksgiving and Christmas. <laughs> That'll show you, principal. 365 days a year. He's inviting the principal over yeah. for Thanksgiving dinner at Hooters. I thought this he accepts. <laughs> I thought this was going like in a direction where he was like, and then he took the mask off, and then they suspended him for not having a mask on. Oh yeah! <laughs> well, ultimate like catch twenty two, and he'd be like, gotcha, bitch. <laughs> Jeez, I don't know. I already saw this story, and I'm like, this is ridiculous. Yeah, but and even like when you go to Hooters, like what the girls are wearing there, like it's not even close to what you'd see some girls wearing out in public these days. You know what I mean? It's like, like, like. Hooters could actually use an update with their with their outfit, you know. Can I actually be honest? So most most <laughs> there we go. Say his wishes. <laughs> most porn clothing, I think, is too revealing. Porn I like clothing? the mystery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The like pasties and the, shit. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I like think the mystery yeah. of the Hooters clothing is way better. Mm, true. Do you like it, it like to be that. more covered up, but just yes. enough to see yeah. a little bit? Because then it's like a little tint. A little it's bit of curvature. It's the nice. Bart Kwan real estate ladies thing. What? I'm sorry. I fully get. Yes, he loves he loves real estate porn videos. Oh, oh, I was confused. I was just like, <laughs> hey, you want to buy the house? Let's close this deal. Let's have sex right now. Like it's it's those videos, right, but they're right. wearing very professional attire. Right. And like you can cover up a woman so much, but you can still see the figure, and so I think it's like that. Mm, you can't hide the figure. You know what I'm saying? Uh, oh, because this kind of reminded me a little bit of when I was, I think I was in third grade, fourth grade something around that, like elementary school. And we were doing this performance on a stage like for the whole school, it was like a thing, right? And my performance was to dance to that song, the 
the stop in the name of love before, before you break my heart. heart. Right? You know. So the song, I mean the shirt that I wore that day, it said sexy on it. <laughs> my mom took me to school with a shirt that said sexy. I already on it. I think eight, I was like in fourth grade. Eight, eight or nine, yeah. <laughs> Something. That's uh that's wow. pretty, yeah. Third, third, fourth grade, I don't mm. remember. But yeah, and then the principal took me off to the side and I was like, you can't wear that. <laughs> And I was like, what? What's wrong? Like, what does sexy even mean? I didn't even know what sexy meant. Oh, oh. actually. Wait, third or fourth grade, you didn't know what sexy meant? No, no, no. I think I was younger. Now that I'm thinking about it, I think I was. She's younger. in preschool. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Your mom got you a shirt that said sexy on it? Yeah. That's weird. Yeah, God, right? Yeah. That's really weird. I. This is the first time I'm really trying to dissect that whole situation. Your mom is really progressive. <laughs> progressive woman. I don't know how I call that progressive. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but I do remember that. And I remember people being like, I remember walking into school and then my, like the teachers be like, and then like taking me off to the principal. And then my mom had to drive to school to bring me a new shirt. Mm. I actually want to ask her now, like, yeah. what's going on? Yeah, be like, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> like, why why did you get me that shirt? Did you find it? And also, what grade was I in? Because I don't remember. But also, if you're eight years old, where'd you find an eight-year-old shirt? This is sexy. Oh, no. Yeah. And it was also kind of like a crop top, too. What? Oh. Yeah, I remember that. I remember, wow. like, my belly was kind of shocked. As right. usual, this turned into a group therapy session. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. JK news. But I will say, um, after that, like I, I think that has been the only item of clothing that I had ever worn in my childhood that was like weird and offensive. Like that wasn't a norm. Like I didn't wear. A whole That's the most weird and offensive thing. <laughs> a, a sexy crop top when yeah. you were nine. Yeah. 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 Apparently, probably younger. Yeah. <laughs> we're, I think we're missing the context. Apparently. <laughs> so you're looking like one of the girls from the Cuties poster. I was right. thinking that too, just now. Yeah. Like just now, Damn. I was like, was it? Did I look like the cutie? Because also, I was like a fucking twig. Like I had oh. zero meat on my bones. I was just a skeleton. I was hey, like, that is sexy though. No, <laughs> don't say that. <laughs> no, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Can I get a little love? Is this like the running okay. gag of the Can day? Can I get a little bit of love? Snip <laughs> this image of Steve Green out of this whole thing. For the guys. <laughs> okay, no love. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, not. I'm gonna go hug my wife. Always win. Always win. Always win. Okay, interesting. No, because right now I'm just like, how old was I? Because I do remember having a thought at the age of six years old, I love you, thank you, that I was like, but I, I do remember asking myself, like, wait, am I sexy? But for a bad reason, it oh. gets dark. Oh. Which I talked about on the Big Mood podcast. If you guys want to check that out, anyway, shout out to Big Mood. We can cut. Oh, okay. I was like, <laughs> how, far, how far are we going with that? 